It was at this downtown Spokane Starbucks. A local man says he gave a note to what he called a flirty barista. He then came back to discover he was no longer welcome at the establishment because the note made the woman feel uncomfortable. In an emailed statement, the man writes, I wrote a note to a barista at Starbucks who was flirty. I'm not a pedophile. You have to be 16 to work at Starbucks. The age of consent in Washington state is 16. I have no idea how old she was, but I do know my actions were polite and legal. The age of consent is 16 in Washington, but only with partners who are less than five years older. In his statement, he continues to say the word creep is a bigoted term, and he thinks what happened is a hate crime. But as we dug into posts he's made online, it became clear this man has an obsession with younger women. A blog he writes includes a lengthy manifesto purporting to have scientific evidence as to why women should only date men older than 35. He also claims he believes the age of consent for men should be raised to 35 years old. We learned the man has a criminal history out of Pierce County, including violating a protection order in 2012. And he isn't just banned from Starbucks. His behavior also got him kicked out of Truth Ministries. In a statement to KXLY4 News, Starbucks said they would not tolerate harassment against employees, which has been praised on their Facebook page. One user writes, thank you for standing up for your young employee who was approached romantically by an older man. As a mom of two teen girls, I applaud a business for standing up for their employees when they feel violated or uncomfortable. Another said, as someone who was in customer service as a teen, I want to say thank you for protecting your employees from harassment.